Hello, super friends, super senior here. We are back here at the marina today, and I'm gonna do kayak. Kayak today, and I'm gonna show you the places where you can go kayaking. But most importantly, I wanna share some safety tips today in regards to preventing shark attack. Uh, for your information, back in July 2013, there is a shark attack here that happened over that area. So it caused death of a person that was beaten by a shark. And I'm going to tell you today what you can do to prevent shark attack. So stay tuned and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so super senior see ya subscribe like and share super senior
during darkness or twilight hours. It's prohibited here anyway. You gotta get off the water by 6 p.m. or 1800. Safety tip number four, do not enter the water if bleeding from an open wound or if you are menstruating. Number five, wearing shiny jewelry Courage, avoid waters with known effluents or sewage and those being used by sport or commercial fishermen. Safety tip number six. Sightings of porpoises do not indicate the absence of sharks. So if there is dolphins or porpoises, you are not guaranteed that there's no shark. They eat the same food. So that's not a guarantee that sharp will not be there. Safety tip number seven, use extra caution when waters are murky and avoid an even tanning and bright colored clothing because they can see contrast very well. Eight, refrain 
provinces in splashing and do not allow pets in the water because of their erratic movements. Too much splashing attracts the shark, it takes to a fish. Nine, exercise caution when occupying the area between sandbars or near steep stream drop offs over there. When you see the um, the dark waters where that's where the drop offs are, and that's where the sharks reside. Okay, number ten, do not enter the water if sharks are known to be present and evacuate the water if sharks are seen. Uh, while there, if you are attacked by a shark, a proactive response is advised. Hitting a shark on the nose, ideally with an animated object, usually result result in shark temporarily curtailing its attack. If a shark actually bites, we suggest clawing at its eyes and peel openings to sensitive areas. So for this safety tip, this is brought to you by Florida Museum and I hope you learned something about how to prevent shark attack, especially during this summer season in other parts of the world. Here in Jet Persia, we are always having a summer. how beautiful this water is. It is crazy enough to go into the water. So just be careful and follow the safety tips that I have given you today. So there you have it people, super friends. I have presented to you tips. How we're gonna be safe in the water when you wanna go swimming. Like in this place where you know there are sharks and also in other parts of the world where sharks are present which is pretty good basically everywhere so I hope you like this video and I hope you learn something from this um, safety tips how to prevent shark attack and if you do like this video, please click that like button and subscribe to my channel. Sposinha! Peace and love! Until next time, see ya!